Hi, I'm Molly with GRS, and this week is the first of a two-part episode, Getting Focused with the Microscope. Well, I have a wonderful electronic invention I want you to see. It, it looks something like this. Hey guys, welcome back to the GRS Training Center. We're going to show you how to focus your microscope. Specifically, we're showing you the A60 Leica microscope with a 0.63 objective lens. We're showing this to you specifically because this is what we sell in our Versa package, but there are other options out there as well. Okay, so a quick overview of this microscope. You have your focus knob, you have a zoom knob, your eyepieces and adjustments are up here, then you have your objective lens down here. So the first thing that we're going to do is actually bring your microscope to your eyes you want to be in a comfortable seated position, but still have good posture. You don't want to be straining your neck up high or slouch down like this because you'll suffer at the end of the day. So in a good seated position, bring your microscope to you. And then with this 0.63 objective lens, you have a fixed workspace of about six inches. So this is a six inch ruler. If you just put it right underneath of your objective lens, that's about where the top of your work surface should hit. If it's lower or it's higher, then you're gonna have to figure out how to bring your work up or down in order to focus properly. So I had a fixed work surface that was higher than this and that made my microscope up really high. So I actually sat in a bar stool and then I put a box underneath of my foot pedal so that I was at the right height for my microscope. Okay, so after you get that done, we're going to adjust the eye tubes to our eyes. So these pull in and out, and it's basically to adjust to the space between your eyes. You're going to push them in or out until you see one clear image. You don't wanna see shadows or um, two different images, you wanna see one clear image. And once you get that, our tip is actually to use a headrest. If you're dodging in and out, then you're gonna get shadows. You're gonna have a sweet spot, which for me is right here. And then I'm gonna bring a headrest to me and lock it down so that I have a solid object that I can rest my head on and I don't have to worry about my image cutting in and out while I'm working. Okay. The next step we're going to do is to zoom your knob to the lowest magnification, which is five on this. And we're going to take our focus knob, which actually brings your microscope up or down just barely. You're going to adjust that up or down until your image is as clear as it's going to get. Once you hit that spot, you're going to zoom it in all the way to the highest magnification, which is 30, and adjust the focus knob again until it's as focused as it's going to get. Okay, so then zoom back all the way out again, a lot of back and forth. and then you're gonna adjust each eyepiece. You wanna start at zero or neutral, which is different on each microscope. For the Leica, it has two dashes. Just go ahead and line those up. And then you're gonna close your left eye and adjust your right eye until it's focused and then switch and do the opposite. Once those are focused, Go ahead and zoom back in all the way and do a final adjustment and you should be good to go. Now you can zoom all the way out or all the way in and remain in focus. If you're not remaining in focus, then just go ahead and start at the first step and do it again. But you should be good to go. Now that you're focused, if your work keeps moving out of view, we can show you how to center it in our next video. Stay tuned.
This week's suggested Instagram user is Jake608 Bauer. Jake Bauer attended the Grand Masters program. He does amazing work. You should go look at it. And then if you decide that you like it and you want him to make you something, he does that. He does custom orders. So go look at it and get him to make you something. Casting call. If you want to be our next suggested Instagram user of the week, then tag us at GRS Tools in your next Instagram post. And if you know of someone that we should be following, throw them down in the comments below. Thanks, guys. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to our channel, like us on social media, all that jazz. Throw your comments down below. Thanks, guys.